Chapter 1 Confusion My father and I awoke unable to move or remember our shared past. Lying flat on our backs, we both calmly stared at the blank ceiling. I somehow knew the two humans towering above us were attempting to help us regain our memories and return to our home world. A gray-haired human pronounced words that I recognized in my own language, yet I did not understand the meaning of his words as he spoke to a young human woman. I am certain we programmed this gnome teenager and her father correctly. However, we may have erred sharing their remembered purpose with the gnome men paired with a female gnome. Unfortunately, we do not have the time to reprogram their consciousness or even their dream consciousness. In a short time, the dock workers will load and ship the cyborgs into an active black hole. The other world wizards who purchased the cyborgs are opening a black hole to transport those gnomes to their world today? Right now? Yes, indeed, young lady. Our cyborg shipment is scheduled to begin in an hour. No more questions, please. I could no longer remain awake to listen to a conversation I did not understand. I fell into a vivid dream consciousness, I realized, standing in my old gnome village of Friendswood, on the enchanted world I would soon rediscover, I hoped. My father flashed me a rare, ear-to-ear -ear smile as he handed me a wooden box created to hold animal feet. I had spent hours examining the images carved across the large box, each picture telling a fragment of my family history. My chest filled with pride, knowing that my father considered me worthy of an honorable gift that most gnome fathers only bestow upon their sons. In my dream, I decided that when awake, I would journal every precious memory of my past, a past I had somehow lost. A thunderous boom interrupted my pleasant dream. Blue bolts of lightning fragmented into spiderweb, like streaks across the open gray sky above me. Sheets of rain crashed down into my eyes, blinding me, the downpour dinging violently off the ship's metal deck. In the distance, a funnel of darkness speared through the turbulent sky. The black hole defied gravity above the ocean that the autopiloted hover vessel sped across. Soon, the inverted black funnel lifted the small ship 